came in and closed the door. Maybe. Oh shit, he's right there! Uh. <laughs> good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in the world. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to some Star Citizen. Hopefully, you're all having a fantastic day today so far. Ladies and gentlemen, I, as I'm recording this right now, I've no idea what the plan is for today, but as you can see by the title, um, you'll know what it is. It's one of those days where I think I'm just going to go out and let the verse take me. Uh, they usually end up, we end up finding something fun to do. Um, I do have some planned videos in Star Citizen coming up. We're obviously going to be doing a fully upgraded Hornet and a fully upgraded Cutlass Black. Those are two videos that you can look forward to coming up this week, uh, but for today... We're just going to go and see where the wind takes us, ladies and gentlemen. I actually want to go find. There's a guy that just walked past me. I think it was an NPC. Uh, it must have been an NPC. Um, and I don't know how he could see a thing. I've never seen his character before. Uh, but his entire face was covered with like... Uh, well, well, we'll see if we can find... <clears throat> yeah, excuse me. I'm recording here. Um, his entire face was covered. You'll know what I mean when I when I show it to you. I can't explain it. But anyway, hopefully you're all having a great day today so far. I just wanted to touch base uh, real quick at the beginning of this video on yesterday's video, um, which was the channel update, me talking about different games that I was considering playing. I said in that video it wasn't 100%. None of it may happen. Some of it may happen. Um, and it, it went down. A lot of people were really interested in space engineers. People, A lot of people said, yeah, you know what? Listen, is, is, I need, do I need to put a sign up somewhere? Like, you can walk in front of me. People, people. A lot of people were interested in space engineers. Um, a few people were interested in Minecraft. And then a few people, like a couple people, took it completely the wrong way. As if I, I even had to go back and watch it and say, what the hell did I say? Because some people thought, took it as if I said, I hate Star Citizen and I'm never playing it again. And I'm switching to something else. Like, <laughs> some people literally were like, oh, well, I, I'm never going to watch your videos again. I'm leaving. I'll go watch somewhere else. So, well, I'm, I'm sorry that you took it that way. <laughs> but it's fine. Um, so yeah, that's not the case, but I'm giving you a quick update on that. So, um, because th I mean, three games is a lot to juggle, okay? It is a lot to juggle. Those were me just throwing those things out into the verse to see what you guys, um, see what you thought about it. And it looks like the decision as of right now is we are starting a, um, a Space Engineers server for the org. Um... And I'm going to be testing that out, just to have fun. So I just want to be clear, Star Citizen is not going anywhere, like at all. I love this game, I'm addicted to this game, there's still so much I want to do in this game, and I can't wait for the uh, the prison system and all that to come out. I'm not leaving this game, <laughs> okay? just want that to be clear. There's still going to be loads of videos, if not at least five videos a week on this game. The reason that I'm doing... Space Engineers, it's just while there's a little downtime right now between patches, we're at the end of one patch going into another, um, and that's where this is, you know, coming into play. Um, so basically, those days, you know, I try and upload daily, but some days I don't post. So the only thing this is going to do is not going to replace necessarily Star Citizen, but it's just going to be those days that I haven't, or I didn't post, there'll be a video that day now. And it'll be Space Engineers. That's literally what's basically going to be happening. So instead of... My plan is to upload daily. I've had a difficult time uploading daily um, Star Citizen videos. So on those days that I... Instead of not posting anything, I'll just post Space Engineers. Does that make sense? So instead of you guys getting nothing, you're going to get something, which is Space Engineers. <laughs> I hope that makes sense. I hope that's how it's going to go anyway. I still have yet to play the game. Uh, tomorrow, just FYI, is going to be the first Space Engineers game. So tomorrow's video is going to be Space Engineers. Listen here, guys. Okay, I I'm trying to be polite, but... Okay, you're not going to do... Okay, thank you. Um, yeah, I haven't played Space Engineers. There is, like, a tutorial, like, for beginners that I should have watched. But I, d I, was, I was about to watch it, and I was like, you know what? I'm not going to watch it. For a first impressions video, I want it to be 100% first impressions. I've seen some screenshots. I haven't watched any videos. I've heard you guys talking about it and saying how great it is. So I'm just going to go into it like completely like cold turkey uh, tomorrow for a first impressions video. So tomorrow you'll get a first impressions video. And then I'll watch the tutorial after my first impressions video, which is kind of the wrong way around. But that's what I'm going to do. And then um, we'll be back to Star Citizen. And then I'll jump in with the org when the server's set up and everything. And we'll go from there. And then they'll just... Those videos are just going to be, like, thread in between 
uh, Star Citizen. So I hope that makes sense. But anyway, Star Citizen's not going anywhere at all. That's just like a little addition to fill some uh, spaces on the channel while we're waiting in between these patches, basically. We'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. But anyway, that's the plan. I've been talking too much now. Let's go figure out something to do and find this guy with the with his face being covered. I, I, you'll see. we got to go find him. I don't know where these NPCs go. All right, let's go. All right, here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Um, so we're lucky. We're going to find this guy first because I really, 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 really need to show you guys what I'm talking about. It's uh, I've never seen the outfit before. I've never seen this character before. And he couldn't see. There's no chance he could see a bloody thing. So let's go see if we can find him. He was literally, he was here and he walked past me just before I was about to do my intro. And uh, I don't know where he could be. I don't know how far the NPCs roam. Do they just go around a little bit? Or do they go around, like, really far? All right, it's not you. It's not you. It was a male. It was a male. Nope. Nope. Don't worry. We're not going to spend the entire day looking for this. But I do really want to find him. You in the bar? Wrong button. Well, you, my lady, have very nice eyes. And you are a real person. Do I believe you're an actual female? Or are you a guy in a female body? Does that sound... That doesn't sound... I mean, someone playing... A f Listen, you got... I don't know who you are, but you've built a very pretty face. That's all I'm going to say. Okay, let's get out of the way from that before that gets awkward. Is it you? No. Who is this person? Now I'm just like... This is a, a player, right? This isn't an NPC. First of all... I mean, it has to be an NPC. Hello? Hi. How are you? It, has, it's, it probably is an NPC, though. Because... I've never seen a helmet that's open before. And they have an empty gun holster. They have... You, uh... Hi. I, I, okay, we're just gonna... We're gonna leave that. That's not what we're here for. We're looking for a fella with his face being covered. Okay, so I don't see him actually anywhere. Would they go upstairs? Would they go downstairs? I've done a loop. You know, I'm, I'm gonna go downstairs just for the bloody sake of it. Because I really do... <laughs> I want to show you what I'm talking I don't want you guys... I, I mean, I've committed. I've committed now. Here he is! There he is! I've never seen this character before, and what is this? Like, how can you see where you're going? Clearly you can't, because you're bumping into me. Look at this. I mean, at least he tried moving out of my way. How? Okay, I was trying to get ahead of you, because I could show... Okay. Are you coming up? Sure are. How is this? How can he see anything? Bro. I don't know. I mean, at least you see what I see now. Okay, now we can move on, but I I don't know how that... What am I doing then? Am I on the floor now? See what I mean? I've never seen this outfit before, and I don't know how he can see me at all. Anyway, we shall move on. I, I digress. Okay, so now we need to go find something to do. So I actually wanted to sneak on board a ship again. Listen, I snuck on a... I did a video where I snuck on... Um, I watched him call it a Carrick. And a video where we snuck on... Oh, it was the same video. We snuck on a Starfarer, which was a lot of fun. But I was told in the comments of that video, you can actually sneak on um, on a mole as well. I mean, chances of me finding a mole are pretty slim to none around these parts. Um, but maybe a part of... But even then, you know, it's difficult to find, um, to find a mole. So I think what we'll do, though... Is we'll head over to Port Alasar. I'm not saying that's what we're going to do in this video. Maybe a mission will pop up and I'll do that instead. But we're going to head over to Port Alasar. And we'll see what's happening. First, let's check our missions though. Just in case something nice is, uh, is popped up here. We're not going to do an investigation. We did an investigation yesterday. Which, by the way, I failed miserably. If I remember, I'll put it up on screen right here. 
Icy sent me a, kindly sent me a bunch of screenshots of where the body was. I walked over it multiple times. I have no idea how I missed it. It looks so obvious when it, in the pictures, but I'll throw them up on screen. Take a look at these. I mean, it's just embarrassing at this point. I'm so mad. I knew it was there. I, ah. I mean, I knew it was going to be around the crash site somewhere. I didn't know it was literally right in front of me, but it is what it is. Anyway, let's continue looking here. Um, eliminate the threat. No, no. No. Any personal missions then on the go? I'd love to do a race, but they don't bloody work. Never have they worked for me. No. I'm waiting for an appointment to pop up, if I'm being honest with you. No bloody appointments. I've been waiting for an appointment now for about a week, and I haven't seen any of them. So that sucks. So anyway, we'll head over to Port Alisar. We'll um, we'll see if we can get anything going over there, and we'll take the Valkyrie because I have a weird feeling there's going to be a patch wipe, and I think we're going to lose our ships. But this is just hearsay. Don't take my word for it. This is just things I've heard through the grapevine. You know what I mean? It may not be true. I hope it's not true. But if there is a wipe, I will miss the ship dearly. I will miss it dearly. Anyway, let's get to the ship. Oh no! Jesus Christ! Every bloody time, I'm an idiot. I mean, it's just, it's fine. It's fine. Let's not. Do we even? We don't even need to discuss it anymore. It's fine. Idiot. There she is, ladies and gentlemen, the Valkyrie. Oh, I hope we get to keep her through this patch. It's been such a good ship for org events. I know. Laven is probably going to buy this thing again, obviously. Uh, this is his baby anyway that I just happen to have in my hangar because... <laughs> I've explained it so many times, I don't need to do it again, but... I'm sure he'll buy one again for the org events, but this thing has been awesome. This thing has been great. Okay, let's go figure out where the bloody hell we'll get what we're up to. Like I say, we'll head over to Port Alisar. And, um, we'll see if we can find ourselves, get ourselves up to some mischief along the way, maybe? I don't know. We're, we're going to figure it out, though. We're going to figure it out. All right, guys, this is it. We're on our way over to Port Alisar. Um, hopefully, we can find a mole right off the bat. That would just be perfect for me, but... We'll see what happens when we get there. Let's go. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we bloody well made it. Not too bad, not too bad. Now, we just have to search for a mole, if that is indeed what we're going to end up doing here today. But uh, <laughs> we'll see what happens. Maybe people are out mining. Maybe they're not. Who the bloody hell knows? I don't want to put my ship down just yet, so we'll wait here a second. All right, bright orange ship. Wherefore art thou? Nothing here. I know it can be black as well, right? Isn't it three colors of the mole? I'm pretty sure there's three colors of the mole. It's the only other ship that I know of. What are you? Never mind. It's the only other ship that I know of that can um, that you can you can get on board. So, prospector. No, I can't do that. Hmm. No one saw that. No one saw that. We're not on fire. You're on fire. You know what? We'll just land it right here. We'll land it right here. Why could I hear that guy refueling so loud? I don't know if you guys heard that. But I just heard someone refueling and it was so bloody loud. <laughs> that I could hear it when I was flying in. Oh my god. Alright, we're here. Can I repair my ship while I'm here? Just for the help? No, of course not. Why wouldn't I be able to repair my ship? You know what I mean? Alright, so where did the moles land? Is it the same place as this? Let's get up a little bit. We're not going to spend too much time looking for a mole. Because that may not necessarily be what this video is about. But, uh, because I don't know. I mean, what are the chances of us finding a mole? You know what I mean? I don't see them very often. So, I can't imagine that I'm going to see multiple. I may wait, wait here just for a second. And I'll skip it ahead for you guys. We'll give it a few minutes. But I can't imagine there's going to be a lot of them. You know? I mean, freelancer, sure. Mole, not so much. But we'll, we'll give it a shot. I'll let you guys know what happens. And I'll, uh, I'll get back to you guys in just a second, I guess. 
So I think this is as good a spot as any. I can see over there. Hopefully, I'll be able to see it if it lands on those two. But if I if I see a mole over here, we're Gucci. All right. I'll come back to you guys in a second. All right. Well, I'll I'll give this a little. I'll stake this out a little bit, and um, I'll we'll see what happens. I'll also keep my eye on missions, see if anything pops up. But I'll be back. <gasps> Why'd you have to be on the other pad? Why? Alright guys, we found one. I'm going as fast as I can over towards it. I finally learned how to boost and do this at the same time. Thanks to everyone in the chat on the last video that says, Why aren't you boosting? Guess what? I'm boosting. This guy's going to be selling it. So we have so much time. I have so much time to sneak on guys on the board this guy's ship. We'll wait until he goes inside. Hopefully he doesn't reclaim it. I'm assuming he's coming here to sell it. To make sure he doesn't see me. All right, where the hell can I get on this thing? Someone said, "All right, well, we have enough time. We have enough time to try and figure it out." While this guy, all right, we've got enough time. Where is the side turret or something that I'm supposed to be getting on here? I'm a little confused. I'm not gonna lie. All right, let's uh, stop here and have a little look. I can't believe it. It took us about 15 minutes. All right, so he's coming down from the bottom. Where are the side turrets you guys are talking about? Someone said you can get on board this through the side turrets. This is going to be a little bit more difficult than I thought, I'm guessing. But we're going to... You bet your ass we're going to try. Maybe what we're going to have to try here is landing on top of it. I don't even see the side turrets. We'll land on top of it, like here, and have a look down. Oh, we found it! We bloody found it, guys. It only took us 15 minutes. I honestly didn't think it was going to be happening here today. But we did. What are the chances? I mean, I'm sure... I don't know what the chances are. But we're coming in. We're coming in. All right, let's make sure we're above it. <laughs> okay, we're going to do this. That was a little close. All right, does anyone see the side... Turrets? Let's make sure we land on top. Someone said that the side turrets are connected? Somehow? I don't know my way around this ship. I don't know where the side turrets are. Uh, Alright, let's just go for it on this side, maybe. Where's the side turret? Am I on a side turret? How do I get inside of this thing? I don't think this is going to be possible. Um, someone said the turrets are on the outside of the ship. This is a turret. How the hell do I get inside of it? We're trying, guys. We're bloody trying. What does this say? Machine move suddenly. Yeah, I get that. Where's the room, though, that people sit in? I'm so confused. We're running out of time. Oh, I don't know how to get inside of this freaking thing. That's not it. Oh, no! Guys, we'll, we'll do a little exploration on the side of this thing. I think we have time. Engines. Right, let's not go that way because he'll see us. Engines. I don't know how I'm going to sneak on si inside this thing. I don't know who said for me to do this, but I can't, I can't see any way for me to get inside. Like at all, unfortunately. I see that one on the bottom. They said the side turrets. I mean, this is the side turret, or the whatever the bloody hell it's called. I don't see the door. I know they're exposed. They said they're exposed. It doesn't look like there's anywhere for me to get on board. Did he leave his bloody door open? Let's just go down. Oh. Oh, he's not here. He left his bloody door open, guys. No! No! Oh! oh he claimed the freaking ship! Oh, he switched it for a freaking... Oh, he was out in his mole. He switched it for a freaking prospector. That's rough. So close yet so far away. My guy even left the bloody doors open. All right. Well, uh, I don't know what to do now. That was... I was so excited. 
Am I gonna fall here? Ow. I was so excited for that, I'm not gonna lie. I just didn't see a way in. I mean, I probably should have looked at the fact that this door was open first. You know? What about this thing? Can we sneak on board one of these? We'll bloody try it. You betcha. That side door. I've stuck onto one of these before. But it was in space, and I think it was unlocked. Wait, is he? Let's just make sure he's not. I think he's good. There's a freelancer over there. With his door wide open. This guy's freaking door's open too! We'll first attempt to get in the airlock. I'm coming in way too fast. As soon as this guy starts moving, this will open. Hmm. No, that's not going to work. I don't know why I was coming in at a thousand freaking meters per second there, but it's fine. We're trying to get in the airlock. The airlock is what we're trying to get into. I was just coming in too quickly. I think we can get into this airlock. No. I mean, his door's open. As soon as he takes off, that, I mean, he's not going to close it. If he's forgot to bloody close it, he's forgot to close it. You know what I mean? Hmm. That guy's now closed his door. Oh, we're having a bloody shocking time trying to sneak on board ships today, aren't we? All right, guys, we pulled ourselves back. We got ourselves a nice view here again. I mean, we had a couple ships there that were, could have been possibilities, but unfortunately they fell through. Um, oh my god, a Starfarer again! I, my look is incredible! The only issue I'm having is, I can't, I'm out, my look's good, but my, um, my execution has been bad. But we know how to get on a Starfarer. This time what we'll do is we'll just sit in the captain's seat. We won't say a damn word to him. We'll just sit in the captain's seat. And wait. Don't come running out that door. Let me get on board your ship first. He can't see us. He can't see us. Ow. Listen, we're on board. Hopefully he's not. I'm not dead, right? Nope. Ah. Right, let's get out of the bloody way so he doesn't see us. He's going to come off that door right there. <laughs> okay, we're on board! <laughs> we're on board a ship. And we come in peace, but we'll see what happens. I need to get to that staircase to go up into the... You know what? I think we'll just stay here. That door needs to stay closed. Let's see if he's on board already. Uh, which one is it? Comms? He's not! He's not on board! So it's not going to pop up saying I'm on board. But it will pop up saying when he's on board. <laughs> Listen, we've tried getting on the mole. It didn't work. This is the easiest, best ship to sneak on. I hear something. This is the easiest ship to sneak on. So, oh, that's close. So this is the ship we're sneaking on. We'll just see where this adventure takes us. See where my boy Bryce, or whatever the name was, takes us, you know what I mean? Oh, shh, shh, shh. He's opening the door. Oh, there he is. Shh, shh. No one's talking in chat. Oh, he's closing the door. He's gonna come up here, run along there through there. And hopefully he doesn't see us. He's not going to look over here, surely. Do I duck down just to make sure? Or do we want to spy on him? He hasn't came upstairs yet. 
No one's talking in chat. Doesn't take that long to get upstairs, buddy. Go on, run upstairs. Come out that door in front of me, run along here. Wait, are we moving? It sounds to me like we're moving. But I don't know if we are moving. I need to remember, he can't really hear when I open doors. Because the front of the ship is super far away. I don't see anyone. Hey, let's sneak. A good place to go is the turret. Because then I can see the location we're going. Thing is, I want to be quiet because I don't know if we're. If we've actually gone anywhere. Let's look out this back door. We're still on Polisar. We haven't moved at all. He came in and closed the door. Maybe. Oh shit, he's right there! Uh. I think this is embarrassing. <laughs> this is embarrassing. I'm being interrogated. Oh, we didn't make it on, did we? Oh, no. Oh, this was, it was worth a try. Oops. It was worth a try, guys. I feel like I don't want to annoy this guy more than I have, so I'll leave. Where's he gone? What is he doing in that thing? He hasn't said anything. Is it just me and him or does someone else bloody sneak on this ship? Nah, it's just me and him. Alright, well I don't wanna... I don't know how he knew I was on board. Let's see if I can ask him. Let's see if he responds to me then we'll get off. I don't know how he knew I was here. Maybe he looked and saw. I can see him over there. I actually didn't know until I saw you. Ah! <laughs> How did he see me? He must have ran up here. So if he comes up here... Oh, that's pretty obvious. I should have been laying down, huh? I, I think I was pretty obvious. Oh, he's gone upstairs. I think I was pretty obvious right there. So let's say he came up here. Turn this way. Mm. All right, well, we got buggered. We got buggered. We got found. Let's just say goodbye. All right, well, we'll leave him. I said good luck out there. I was waiting for him to respond, but... Well, 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 well. Starfarer is still undefeated at being able to... Ouch. Sneak on this bad boy. It's just the easiest ship to sneak on, if I'm honest. Other than the, uh, the Karak. But the Karak, you can't get inside. Do you know what I mean? The, the freaking... What you would call it? The mole. I have no idea how to sneak on. Not a not a clue. We're gonna attempt it again. But I need if you if you were the one that told me that, how would you sneak on the mole? I from what I read is you sneak on the turrets are connected to the ship supposedly, like the mining turrets, the mining lasers, and you should be able to jump onto the turrets. From what I read, I thought it would be easier. If I'm honest, I thought it would be more like this. How this thing has the mesh that you can jump onto. I thought that's how the mole would be. Um, obviously not though. But it's fine. We'll uh, we'll continue. I'm so glad you guys told me about using the thrust boost. When you're floating around like this. Because now I can actually get to all of these pads fairly quickly. Uh, which definitely helps. So, Alright, anyway guys. I'll come back to you guys in a second. I'm just going to sit here for a minute. See if there's any other ships we can find. And we'll uh, we'll go again. We will continue. The odds of us sneaking on board ships, though, has increased. Because now I know there's three, or the potential of three, if the mole is one. Uh, the Carrick, the Starfarer, and the mole. 
That's good to know. That's good to know. I'm gonna have to practice on the mole, though. If we see one, we'll get inside of it. But it's good to know that it lands on these pads up here, though. Or those ones. I see a caterpillar. Looks like it's coming in. Right here. Can't really sneak on board a cat. Unless... Oh, wait! Someone did tell me you can sneak on board a cat! Oh, he's coming in that way, though. Please do an auto land so you face the opposite direction. So, we'll test the cat, a pillar theory. I don't know if it's going to work. But even if it does work, they're going to find out we're on board real quick. And I, I kind of don't want to mess with caterpillars, though. Nah, we're not even going to attempt to sneak on a cat. I don't even want to mess with caterpillars. I don't even want to show people how to sneak on caterpillars. Caterpillars are the trade behemoths of this game right now, guys. Right? They're the trade behemoths. There's a lot of money on board of those things. It's very stressful as someone that trades myself flying those things. Um, so I, I don't want to... I don't even want to mess with that. Even though I'm friendly and I'm not going to. You know, um, I, w I wouldn't hurt them or anything like that. I'm not... I'm staying away from cats. I feel like someone's going to be mad at me because I'm giving special treatment to cats. So we're just going to go on the cat. We're going to attempt to get on the cat. We'll see what happens. But we'll attempt it. We'll attempt it. An attempt will be made. And uh, like I say, we're friendly. But hopefully we'll teach this caterpillar owner to always check their comms to make sure no one's on board their ship. If we do manage to get on. If we don't, then good for the caterpillar. You can't get on it. Everything's... What the hell is happening to that fellow over there? <laughs> Everything's good in the world if we can't get on it, but we're going to attempt it anyway. This guy's probably... Uh, if he is trading, he's probably... He hasn't even landed yet. I don't want to freak him out, you know what I mean? Is he in there? He's still in the cockpit, so let's not be obvious here. Oh, he's landing. There's a lot... This place is... Freaking popping off right now, 11 a.m. on a bloody <laughs> Wednesday. All right, he's landed it. So what we'll do is we'll wait for him to get out and go in. He's left the pilot seat by the looks of it. So we'll just give him a second. A lot of colorless blacks around today. A lot of colorless blacks. All right, now I've never done this before on a caterpillar. So, it may take a few attempts, so we'll just go ahead and try it right away. But supposedly, you just need to get on the front lip. Oh god, he's right there! <laughs> I flicked it, see? Fail, fail, retreat, retreat! Standing right there. He may be desync though. You know, we'll try it again. This time we'll come in faster. So that I should hit this thing and drop. Too low. Try it again! Retreat! Retreat! Alright, so we've got to come in fast. <clears throat> no one saw that one, did they? <laughs> I don't even know if this is going to work. Damn it, we keep doing it. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. I don't even know if you can stand on there from this point of view, to be honest with you. Nailed it. Oh, look! It says we're in. We're standing on it. The <laughs> Oh, this may be a thing. I don't, I mean, I hope he doesn't claim the ship. But uh, it says we are on board the ship. So I didn't even, I, 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 uh, <laughs> we're learning things today. This is learning. You know, I do this so that you guys make sure that nobody's on your ship. And maybe CIG will patch it and fix it. You know what I mean? So uh, that's why we're doing this. But ladies and gentlemen, look at us. Hey, <laughs> on the beast itself. All right, let's, uh. Let's see what happens. Hopefully, we don't die here, but we'll see. The button to open this, I'm pretty sure, is below. I don't think I can open it from here, and I don't think I could open it anyway. But what a bloody view if this actually works from here. 
Hopefully he's just, you know, trading scrap. So he doesn't get a little, um... You know, he doesn't claim his ship. But... We'll see what happens. This could be fun. Caterpillars are always freaking workhorses, you know what I mean? We'll see what happens. Wait, what did that just say? Haggins has joined. Okay, so Haggins... Is on board. <laughs> Alright, I'm a little nervous. I'm not gonna lie. But... We'll see. There's a button down there to open the doors, but it, it's not... I, it's out of my reach, so I can't even attempt to open this door. And if I did, it would push me out, I believe. Like, it would literally push me out anyway, because these doors go forwards and then open. So if someone was to open these doors... We're bloody moving. We're bloody well moving. This is terrifying. Okay, we're, we're on board. <laughs> it's moving. We're going up. We're going up. Where are we off to, Haggins? I will be your, uh, I'll be your pilot. I'll be your captain. I'll just look. How about that? I'll keep my eyes out. Make sure nothing's blocking our view here. Oh God, he's spooling. <laughs> he's spooling! Oh no. Where are we going? We're going far by the looks of it. We're going straight into the blood zone. Alright, here we go. No, no, no. Oh no. Oh. Uh. I can't believe this actually worked. Because this isn't what I thought was going to happen from what people have, have mentioned to me. Um. Look at this for a view. From what I was told. Is that you glitch into the ship? But we're not glitching into the ship. We're literally just standing on the outskirts of it. So theoretically, um, we, we probably aren't even going to be able to sneak inside of this thing anyway. So no harm, no foul. So even if you do manage to board on a caterpillar, you can't do anything. You can't get inside. But you can kind of tag along. <laughs> right. Well, guys. Well, we're going on a bloody adventure. What did I say? We'll see where we end up. Uh, see where this cat's doing some trading. And we'll go from there. Good old trading brother here. Good old trading brother. Let's see what he's up to. What a view, though. Maybe I'll time-lapse this for a minute while I, uh... Until we get there. Alright? Let's go. Guys, so we're coming out of quantum by the sounds of things. This is very mesmerizing though, just like staring straight into this while we're going. I mean, when do you ever get this view? <laughs> this is an incredible view. Um, but we've crossed the mark now. The quantum drives just made their little noise. We should be, uh, I can see some flickering, but that's probably nothing. It's probably just something to do with the uh, quantum. Foot. Oh. Now here's the thing, do we stay on board? I don't know where we are. Let's see if I can see. All right, so we're at her L1. That's where this guy's gone. It actually looks cool like this view, you know what I mean? Like this, <laughs> when it's all blurred. It looks cool blurred. All right, let's not, let's not get too carried away with how it looks blurred. Let's see what's happening here. I wonder what he's getting at her L1. Do you think he's stocking up on something, or, or, I don't know. Are we even moving? I can't tell. We're not moving, guys. I don't know what's happening. Oh, never mind. Scratch that. We're on the move. 
One of you guys actually gave me an idea of something to do while we're on board these ships, and I may actually do it. Uh, I won't do it now. We'll do it if he jumps again, which is to get on the uh, the ship comms, because supposedly in ship comms, even if they're not connected, if I start talking over ship comms, he'll be able to hear it. So we may <laughs> we may do that. We may do that. But for right now, uh, Foyp's not working because we're coming in here. But for right now. We're just going to see what's happening. I can't imagine he's going to stay here for long, right? Her L1. But we'll see what happens. I don't know what this guy is doing. Oh, I think we're landing? I can see markers. See that marker? But I have no idea what we're doing here. Really no idea. Imagine if he's logging out for the night. I don't even know where we are. He's lining up with these orange things. Oh, we're going back even further. Oh. Oh, he's backing up into the hangar. Never seen someone back up into a hangar before. What's the point in this then? The thing is, if he's not fast in doing whatever the bloody hell he's doing in here, this ship could despawn. So, but at least now, my chances of sneaking on board ships have gone up even further. Because now I have the, this shit, the Caterpillar, the Starfarer, the, uh, the Carrack, and possibly the Mole. If I know how the Mole works. Alright, my boy's landed. Doors are closing. Very close to the front, actually. I can't get off. Because if I get off this, there's no way of me getting back on this. <laughs> so I'm going to have to wait here for a minute, guys. Um, I'll let you know what happens. But as of right now, I don't think I can get off. Please don't be too long, Mr. Man. Don't be too long. I will be... Waiting for your return to the ship. Thank you very much, sir. Oh, no! Literally hurt my face. He opened all the doors so we could get off, which pushed... All right, I need to... No! No! He's done it again. Stop it! He's trying to push me off. Do you think he knows I'm on board? I hear the doors opening. I can't believe this thing didn't open. Did I block it? Or was I just lucky that he cancelled it before? Oh my god, my heart almost dropped there. Thought we were goners, guys. Thought we were goners. Hey. Oh, no. Uh, hello. <laughs> Shit, we've been found. What's happening? Oh, you know. Chilling? What are you doing down there? <laughs> Just fulfilling all of my space trucking requirements, including a walk around and a daily log. Oh yes. How did I get up here? <laughs> oh no! Well, this is awkward. Oh no, we've been found, guys. You stuck? Uh, no. When you opened the doors, I almost fell off, though. Okay, well, have a nice day, I guess. 
Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm down. I am friendly. Alright, I'll leave you be. Okay, well, have a nice day. You too. Oh, wow. What a nice guy. <laughs> he does... How do we find someone that does a, a walk around? Talk about bloody role playing or whatever. Jesus. This guy lands his ship and does a walk around. You left your engines on. You're clearly not paying that much attention. That was funny. Oh my god. When did you figure out that I was there? Um, I always check with F1 because it lists everybody who's in the comm channel for the ship. But when did you realize that I was on your ship? Like pretty early on, but my ship's been empty so I didn't really care. Okay. I wasn't going to do anything. I was just trying to see where we were going. Well, have fun. Good luck out there. I trade as well, so I even said that I would never uh, I would never harm a trader. So, good luck. You too. Have a good day. You too. All right, nice guy. Nice guy. All right, but now we're, we're now we're all over the place. I need to get back to Port Alisar because he said he realized pretty... I mean, that guy seemed like he knew what he was doing, you know what I mean? The fact that he tried pushing me off and it didn't work was quite... Why are all my ships, like... All right, guys, I'll be right back. I'm just going to spend a second claiming all these so I can actually use ships when I need them. All right, guys, so I've officially... Look how many of these things look are being claimed right now. I don't know why all my ships are all over the place, but they are. So I need to figure out how to get over to Port Alisar in a pretty decent amount of time. Uh, we have a prospector, a yellow jacket, that's not going to work, a gamma, I don't even know if it has enough fuel to get over there. Um, I don't know what to take. I really don't know what to take over there at this point. How long will it take me to expedite the Cutlass Black? A minute. Alright, we'll just expedite this thing. Alright, I'll meet you guys in a second. Oh my god. You know, at least he was a nice guy. And, uh, that's so funny, though. Said he's doing his daily walk around. <laughs> oh, God. It was cool, though. Uh, we couldn't get on board the ship, but we could, uh, get on the front of it. So you can at least go on little journeys with people. It's kind of similar to the Carrick, I guess, in that sense, because you can't really get on the Carrick either. For yet, I don't know. Maybe we'll figure out a way to. But, uh, wow. Yeah, that was good. All right, I'll meet you guys in a sec. Oh, it looks like we got a 30k. Local's been disbanded. I figured as much, to be honest, that when I was retrieving my ships, it was a little awkward. So I'll be back after 30k, I guess. So, uh, let's do this thing. 30k. Go. Do it. Now. Hello. Any 30k here? There we go. Alright, guys, we are back at Port Alisar. Uh, I'm thinking we try... Going a little too quick here. I think we try to do one more. I think that's the plan here. We attempt one more. Let's see what ships we got around us. We got a freelancer. What's that thing that's flying around all over the place? I don't know. Anyway, I think we'll attempt one more. Because I don't know how long this is uh how long we've been doing it. It's taken a while, obviously, for me to get all get on board all of these things, but I think one more will be fine. Do we wait at the top up here and glide down? Or do we go here and glide across? Or do we just sit in the ship and wait? Hmm. You no, know we'll put the ship down. We'll put the ship down. She's down. All right, now we just need to figure out if we're going to be able to get on one more. Who's the lucky ship going to be? So we've got another caterpillar coming in. I don't know if this is... Uh, do we do a cat again? I don't know if a cat's the one. I don't know if the cat's the wall, but it's been pretty quiet. I'm not going to lie. I've been waiting. It's been pretty quiet. I just don't know. Do we try the caterpillar again? The hell's this thing shooting at? Oh, okay. Like I say, I feel weird doing it to cats just because of how much, how stressful it is trading in a cat. I don't want to add to that stress, but 
If nothing else shows up, maybe we'll have to finish off with another caterpillar. You know what I mean? You know what, this time what we'll do, if we get on the caterpillar, we'll go into the ship comms and we'll talk to them through ship comms. That's what we'll do. Unless something else shows up. Which... Yeah, it's not. Alright, let's get on board. Sorry, caterpillar. <laughs> I really am, but... You're the only one here. I'm sorry. Alright. So we perfected this once. Can we do it again? Can we do this one more time? Wait, are they on board still? Is he still in the cockpit? No. Is he left, though? Oh! Ooh, that was scary. Did he leave his ship? Oh, he's going... Okay, he's on his way in with a delivery of all things. Wait, is he still standing there looking at me? Nope, he just ran in. Okay. What's he doing delivery missions in a freaking caterpillar for? You know what? To each his own. Oh, we bloody did it. Blue hair! This guy's got blue hair and he just don't care! Sorry, that was cringe. Alright guys, we're on board blue hair's caterpillar. Uh, this time, we'll see what happens. If we can glitch into the ship, that'll be great. If not, we'll go on ship comms. Oh god, he claimed the bloody ship. <sighs> The lights on the colony are like the same brightness as the sun. I've, it's, it's, it's been decided. Oh! Ah! <laughs> All right, we're going, we're going, we're going. Full speed ahead, full speed ahead, full speed ahead. Hopefully, this guy isn't on board yet, so he doesn't see me enter his ship. Hopefully, this thing has just been claimed. We're going for it. Now I'm going to slow down a little bit. Nope, speed up again, speed up again. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's slow down. Coming in for landing. Everyone hold the horses. Legatin. 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 Is he on board? That is the question we need to ask ourselves. He's not on board. All right, perfect. So we got here before him. Ha ha, ladies and gentlemen. Tis I, the Carrick Rider. Yeah. Anyway, we're on board. We'll see where this thing takes us. Oh, that's, that's my, that's my colors black. Mm. Anyway, we're on board. Maybe we'll go on ship comms on this guy. That's what we'll do. We'll go on ship comms. Let's see what, do we attempt to see where he's going first? You know what? Let's just get in the corner. Like a good person. Here we go. And wait. All right, guys, he's on board. He's on board. Hopefully he doesn't check his thing. Do we keep an eye on chat and keep our eyes out for him? Updates. Nothing's happened. I'm waiting to see if he knows. I mean, he doesn't know I'm here. He's on board now. But we haven't. Uh, he hasn't said anything. Chat. The engine hasn't turned on. Nothing's happened. So. I don't know what it is with Carrick pilots. But it's the only ship that I've snuck on that does this. You know what I mean? It's the only ship, maybe because it takes about half an hour to get from the entrance to the cockpit, maybe? But every time I sneak on a ship, this thing takes forever. What is that? Anyway, updates to follow when we figure out what's happening. Update. Still, uh, still here, waiting for whoever's in this ship to do something with it. Not, not much is happening, really. Look, still, um, still here. I don't know if he knows I'm in on board and he's looking for me or what, but no word yet. We'll keep you posted. I can hear him walking around in the ship. Maybe he is looking for me. Uh oh, no, 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 no! Get back to where you were so it doesn't say you left the bloody ship. Well. Idiot. <clears throat> no one saw that. But he's not in here. That's for sure. We'll keep you posted. Ah. Poor Olisar has joined the channel. Who the bloody hell is Poor Olisar? Other than the actual place where we are. Who's Poor Olisar? <laughs> Alright, we got two people on board. 
Imagine if he's just sitting on the other side. No, he's not. <laughs> right, well, we've got two people in here now. Which makes it a little bit more exciting. Oh, wait, what's happening now? Portosaur's left. Uh, what's that guy doing? So it says he's joined. Is there another place you can go on this ship that you land? I'm pretty sure there's a guy up front that is doing the same thing I'm doing. Do we investigate? Listen, if there's another place for us to hide. No! He's a freaking pad rammer. <sighs> He's a pad rammer. What a dick. What a dick. Well, I forgot his name, but we all know who it is. What a dick. That's not my ship. I'm not a part of it. That guy literally just took off real quick. Oh, that poor 600. You think 600 is going to make it? Let's find out. Wait. Did the characters blow up? Or did he just blow up somebody else? I think the character's still alive. I think he just took someone out that was on the zero strut, though. What a dick! I don't want to be a part of that crew. Imagine if I was on board. I should have stayed on board. That would have been quite a cool view, though. Oh. He's trying. Ha <laughs> ha, sucker! Snooze, you lose! He's really trying. Was there another place on board? Look how fast this bloody thing is. I was just trying to look for another place on board. I'm not even going to be able to get on one now, am I? Because of this idiot. Someone says they're recording him. Can they do something from recording him? I mean, obviously I've recorded everything this guy's done. But can you even do anything from recording? Will they actually... Because they don't ban people, right? For pad ramming. I mean, he clearly doesn't give a shit. That poor thing. Alright, guys. I think we're going to have to call it there. You know, just with having a troll like that, you know, in the server, I don't want to look like I'm trying to be like that, you know what I mean? Even though it's, you know, obviously not me. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed it. This is part two of us sneaking on board ships. And uh, I had a lot of fun. I still can't get over that guy that in the cat that walked around his ship. It's like, hello. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was great. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day, and I'll see you tomorrow. Don't forget, Space Engineers, tomorrow. Uh, it's just going to be my first impressions video, and then back to Star Citizen on uh, Friday? What day? I, I, do, I don't even know what day it is anymore. The days are all blended together. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, hit the like button, subscribe if you're new, turn on the notifications, and all that good stuff down there. And I'll see you guys tomorrow with a brand new video. Goodbye. That was weird. Bye.